Hi everyone, just wanted to say thank you and welcome back to the Oval Beauty channel. Just wanted to touch a little bit on um, today's topic, which is going to be about all about natural beauty and accentuating your beautiful self with just natural makeup. And it's something that I have been exploring a little bit more. Um, it's hard because you get used to you get used to the Tarte Cosmetics and you get used to MAC Cosmetics and you get used to Sephora brands and you get used to Anastasia Beverly Hills and you get used to Morphe. So you get used to all these brands that have a variety of products out there that have a variety of ingredients as well. So um, as much as I'm very familiar with those products, um, I wanted to take this time to kind of get a little bit more familiar with products that um, I think will be more beneficial for me and more beneficial for you guys as, as far as in the long run. Um, I actually was able to check out EWG um, and their website and kind of get a better background and understanding of the type of products, um, sorry, the type of ingredients that are in these kind of products that we love so much um, and that we wear every day because I actually... Before exploring um, these more natural products, I actually was a huge purchaser of um, products that have things that are a little bit more, um, a little bit more ingredients in them, a little bit more chemicals in them. So that's why I wanted to come to you guys and kind of give you a little idea of what's out there, um, what can be beneficial, what can be useful, what you might not want, and what you might want to use. So definitely wanted to make sure that I kind of touched on that for you, but. I won't get too long into the video, but just wanted to kind of um, give you that background. EWG is a website where they verify ingredients in products that they deem as um, that they deem as something that's more um, healthier, or the ingredients are not as harsh, they're not as cancer causing, or they're not. Um, as damaging to your cells, you know, how rapidly they get into your blood, your bloodstream. So they actually have a lot of information, really great information, especially if you're someone that's looking more into getting um, into natural products and getting into products that are a little bit better for your skin. Definitely check out their website. I'll make sure to put the link in the description um, bar below and then that way you can kind of go back and take a look at it and see if it's something that you're definitely interested in. I know I kind I fell in love with the website once I found out a little bit more about it I was like all right this is for me so without further ado let's kind of talk a little bit about what I got so I actually I'm just gonna grab I actually got all the products at Whole Foods not all of them but the majority of them between Whole Foods and Ulta um, and I spent quite a bit on these products but I feel like hopefully I feel like it's all worth it um, I'm very happy to have spent the money and to be able to have something that's gonna be better on my skin than to spend the money that I spend when I when I'm going to alter Sephora and have something that's not good on my skin so I figured you know what I might as well just spend this money now um, and enjoy some cleaner products um, on my skin because I think that that's very important to me especially someone who is on a journey of you know being a vegan and um, being on that journey I definitely wanted to make sure that that reflects in a lot of the things that I do um, especially the things that I put on my skin so definitely um, let's get into it so I got from Whole Foods a couple things so I got the radiant shimmer the radiant shimmer coconut multiples and this is a highlighter and it's highlighting creams for eyes lips and face and this is a hundred percent vegan and cruelty free you can see that the lighting is a little funky today but sorry about um sorry about the lighting but so this product which i thought was pretty interesting um 
if I can get it open. Uh, but I thought it was pretty interesting because it is 100% cruelty free and it's vegan. And um, some of the ingredients was seed oil, safflower, safflower seed, um, vitamin E, um, and just when you they um, when you go on the website, you can kind of get a better idea of you know, all the different ingredients in the products and, and definitely check it out just to see if it's something that you would be interested in. But this is definitely one of them. The next one is the Beachy, does that say Beachy Punk? Coconut Infused Mineral Eyeshadows. And this is also from Pacifica as well. The last um, eyeshadow is from Pacifica. This one's also from Pacifica. Pacifica. I'm trying to take it out of the, but it looks like it doesn't want to come out. Um, but yeah, so this one's from Pacifica as well, and what I really just like about the product is the fact that it is vegan and the fact that it has definitely more healthier um, ingredients in them, and that's just so important, especially if you're just on a journey for just health in general. It's just definitely vital for you. So the moment I can get this out of here, um, I'll definitely show you guys a little bit about these products but i just kind of want to give you the background of the products i'll do a tutorial as well so you can kind of have an, an idea of what they look like on your skin um i also got from uh, whole foods this face primer and this one is from mineral infusion and mineral infusion on the ewg website is um they are verified from EWG as products that are less harmful on your skin than other products. Um, so I'm not saying that these products won't cause any harm or it won't irritate your skin. What I'm saying is that it's less irritation, which I think is beneficial for you. And then the next one I got was the liquid eyeliner. You can see that. And I also got a concealer, which when I say I went into the store, and this color is olive. So, guys, I hope that I, I hope that this works for my skin and actually for my complexion. Because when I say the complexion products are lacking in, in that department, it is lacking. Um, and I only say that because... I I really I, I like putting on makeup and I enjoy it so it's like to to go somewhere and to not f have anything to go after to not be able to like just be like oh, okay this could be my color this could be my color it was tough for me because I'm like in the store and looking at all the shades and I'm like all right this is possibly one that I can go with and I mean it doesn't it looks definitely different from the bottle than it does the color. So I was like, you know what, this might be able to um, go right underneath my eyes. Hopefully it works out. Um, I'll definitely show you that in a little bit in the next video. So don't forget to uh, check out the next video because the next video will definitely have all of the tutorial options on here. Um, and then the next thing that I got was the Volumizing Mascara in Jet Black. So that's kind of what I got from, um, that's what I got from Whole Foods. Those were just some of the items that I got from Whole Foods um, as far as like the healthier makeup options. I wanted to get some items that I'll be able to review and kind of go over and see if it's something that you guys um, are interested in. I'm definitely interested in it. I'm so happy that I got it and I'm so happy that um, I'm taking a step closer to my goals. So I'm definitely proud of that. Um, and then, so this is the bottle here, but this says jet, but for some reason the bottom is brown. So I'm just going to take a quick peek and see if it's actually brown. No, it looks black. Might just be the, might just be the color. It definitely looks black. So I'm not really sure why that's brown because even the rim around here is brown but whatever 
So um, what I also went and did because I my Clarisonic brush was actually um, my Clarisonic brush it was old, so I just had to replace it. So I ended up going to um, I ended up going to Ulta to grab the rest of the things that I was kind of looking for because I was looking through Ulta and I couldn't find any vegan options, anything like that. So I was like, all right, let me go and ask someone to see if they might know like what could I choose what you know what do you guys think so she actually pointed me in the direction which was all the way in the back of the store and it was um, a couple different brands but I this is the brush I picked up you can see that there the Clarisonic and this brush head I picked up because I actually have the actual Clarisonic um, brush and but this brush is the makeup brush that I have on it now um, but it's interchangeable so you just literally pop this off and then you just pop it back on snap it into place and then it's back on and then literally you just switch it over with this brush when you're cleansing your face and then you can I use my um, Clarisonic makeup brush to put my foundation on as well because it like vibrates and it's pretty cool like you can hear it oh. And you're just like put it on your face um, and then the next thing I got from Ulta which I was pretty nervous about because again complexion products does it work for my skin blah 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 is it gonna look good on me I mean is, is it even my color so um, that was another thing that I was kind of concerned about but I got it anyways just to see to test it out and see if it's something that I'll be further interested in um, this one is from juice beauty and if you can see that there so basically juice beauty it says that um, after you apply well, actually the ingredients in here are supposedly um, vibrant plant derived pigments um, fruit stem cell skin care technology moisturizing cold pressed oils organic based um, organic base of botanical juices waxes and powders so this is what this looks like. I don't know if you guys have ever heard of Juice Beauty or I've never heard of Juice Beauty. And I was just like, um, what is this? I want to know. So I was like, oh, let me try it out. It's very liquidy, very liquidy. Like, I don't know if you can see that, but like, it's like, it's just like a liquid. It's just very, very liquidy. Um, I wonder if I take the top off. Yeah. So like literally that's what it looks like in there so <laughs> I'm looking at it amazed because like I don't know or I've never heard of this product before I mean I'm so used to the Morphe's the max the um, Smashbox cosmetics of the world so this is definitely something that I've never heard of so I was just like ah, I'm not really sure but I got that color because one this was the darkest shade Who knows we'll see and then this was another one that I picked up and it's also from juice beauty and it basically says the same thing moisturizing cold pressed oils organic based botanical juices waxes and powders so this is this juice beauty and it's pretty cool it looks very liquidy as well um, I think that's just the consistency of their products but I thought it was very interesting and I was just like, all right, let me try it. Let me try something new. Let me get out of my comfort zone and let me just dive right in. But um, what I want to say is I'm going to try these out. I'll come back to you guys with another video and just show you a little bit about what it looks like on my skin. How does it look? And we'll kind of go from there. But I just want to say thank you so much for coming to my page. Thank you so much for subscribing. Um, thank you so much for supporting me. And um, I look forward to continue to bring you guys great videos that you're looking forward to. So if you are not already subscribed, definitely come back and subscribe to my channel. Um, come back and watch videos. Come back and enjoy everything with me. Just want to say thank you so much again for coming back and watching me today and don't forget to subscribe hit the like button and also comment just in case you have anything that you want to let me know but definitely check out the next video bye guys